What's up, y'all? This is your girl, Jazz Shaman, and this is a Let's Talk video, all right? First off, we're going to talk about personal finance. It's going to be real quick. I'm not trying to give any tips or anything, but you know these Let's Talk videos are basically, you know, something to think about. So lately, I have been trying to get my finances together. I have been reading... Um, the Motley Fool Personal Finance Workbook. I went to the library and checked it out. Um, I would show y'all it right now, but it's kind of holding up this cord to the webcam. Sorry. Anyways, but yeah, um, I want y'all to think about y'all personal finances. Most people that I know. They don't exactly care about their finances if they're working. They'll talk about saving. And usually it's saving eventually. You know, not even saving now. And, you know, I'm not perfect or anything, but I aspire to be rich. <laughs> and I know that just saving is not going to make you rich. All right? Everybody may not want to be rich, but it's important to be Financially stable. Um, saving is cool. It's good. But what about investing? What about, um, you know, retirement funds? What about insurance? Now, we can get sick. And you need insurance. We can get sick. Get in the hospital, get out, and guess what? Be bankrupt. Because we don't have insurance. We didn't have the money. We didn't anything. Like, personal finances is just important. Paying off those student loans, paying off your credit card bills on time. Not getting as much, you know, as many credit cards. Um, saving, budgeting. It's all important. So I'm just, you know, basically putting this out to the universe so we all can really just think about investing and do more than saving. Think about investing in, in stocks, mutual funds, um, you know, 401ks, try, you know, check those out. Residual income, check that out. You know, just... It's it's very important to have our finances together. It's it's crucial because you don't want to be in that position where you're living paycheck to paycheck. You don't want to be in that position where something serious might happen and you ask out. So truly think about your finances. Um, for one, stop ignoring the bill collectors' calls. Actually try to answer their call. See if you can set up some type of repayment plan so you can get your, you know, your situation under control. It's very important. Most people don't even, they don't even really teach personal finances in school, high school. Most people that I know don't even really care that much. You know, they just care that they can pay their bills when they can pay it. You know, pay it on time. But they're not thinking about the future. They're not thinking about living comfort, you know, comfortable. So it's like, yeah, I don't want to be like that. I want to have my finances in order. You know, really just think about how you doing things. And what about your goals in life. And, you know, try to write that down. Try to see where you're at and what's, you know, what what are the things that you need to do to take you there. So, that's basically it. Um, like, share, comment, and subscribe. You know, because if you share and like this video, more people are going to see it. And hopefully it can help more people. We truly need to start taking responsibility for our finances. It is. I mean, if you need to bring in more income, bring in more income. But you do, you do need to know how to manage your finances. I mean, you can have all the money in the world, make all the money in the world. It doesn't mean anything. 
<laughs> if you don't know what to do with it. Plenty, you see all these these NBA players and these celebrities, they were on top, then they, you know, at the bottom, they're no longer relevant, and they're broke. You know why? Because they didn't take care of their finances. They were out there like Allen Iverson, I believe. He was buying clothes every freaking day. He wasn't even, like, taking luggage with him. He was just buying clothes. That is very reckless spending. Very immature. And now he's, you know, he ain't like he used to be. But that's it, y'all. Um, Y'all have a nice evening, day, morning, whatever it may be. And that'll be all, folks. Peace out.